Hello, this is Michelle Knight, and welcome to your weekly astrology. This week, we've got a new moon, so it's all change. There's a big pattern shifting. And on top of that, we have Venus, the planet of love, squaring Pluto, the lord of transformation. So expect fireworks when it comes to lust and passion. Here's your weekly astrology. Sagittarius, this week we have a new moon and it's all pretty full on. Now this new moon is all about relationships for you. New moons are about letting go of baggage, surrendering stuff that doesn't serve us. Okay, it could mean that you decide or someone else decides to end a relationship, but it could also equally be a new beginning in a relationship. And it it might just be a symbolic ending rather than a literal ending. You're at the end of a cycle and you're ready for a new beginning. And this new beginning is very positive. You're laying new seeds, you're thinking new thoughts. Actually, you really want harmony in your life and you're going to work hard to create harmony in your life. Okay, the moon is square. Neptune so you may be feeling a little bit uneasy around your home or not really feel as in tune or relaxed as normal but don't worry that only lasts a day or two Um, in fact it might be good for you to go out and about on that day because the moon is trying Jupiter in your social sector so when you go out you get lucky and you feel good so um, usually I'm always telling people to stay in and, and get cozy and recharge but on this occasion I'm saying go out enjoy yourself let your hair down Now, also, be be a little bit cautious, though, because Venus, the planet of love, is square Pluto, the lord of transformation. And this is a very intoxicating, overwhelming, primal energy. And you've got it in your position of sex, soulmates, and playfulness, um, and also security. It may be that you wildly, passionately attracted to someone, or you're not thinking, you overspend, or you buy something for a lover, just because... you're feeling it but maybe not even doing it for the right reasons whatever you do don't feel insecure honor and love yourself you can find that harmony within relationships by doing the work on you and setting some firmer boundaries yeah it's going to be intense this moon but it's up to you where you channel your thoughts and your energy and if you do it in the right way you will find harmony but don't surrender your power and don't get into any power struggles if you can avoid it Take care, gorgeous, and I'll speak to you soon. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and share if you do. And I've got a little present for you. If you go to horoscope.co.uk, I now have not only a free chart wheel, but free birth chart interpretation. So pop along and have a look. Take care and I'll speak to you soon.